Hey, hey, hey. So I'm going to be giving you today four different hacks on how you can get your fan page post showing up in more people's news feeds. So um, let's go ahead. The first one, when you're on your fan page, start liking, commenting, and engaging on other fan pages as your fan page and not just your personal profile. As other people are engaging on those fan pages, guess what's going to happen when they hover over your name? They're not going to go to your profile. They're going to go to your fan page, and that's what you want them to do, right? Number two, what you can do is take, for instance, if you go live. So if you have like, you know, several tips, hey, if you just have four tips, go live from your profile or just do a regular status update and then say, hey guys, I'm actually gonna be giving a few more tips over on my fan page. Go there, check it out, bada bing, bada boom. You've got some exposure over on your fan page. Third little hack, and that is to go live. Like, live video. And let me just tell you, Facebook has already mentioned, like, a ton that they want you to use live video. Why? Because they want to be better than, like, YouTube and, and everybody else they're competing with who do live streaming. So what they're going to do is if you're using the feature that Facebook wants you to use, they're automatically going to push it out into more people's newsfeed. Now here's where I'm gonna give you two other little hacks when it comes to using live video. Number one, if you go live from your fan page, you can actually tag your profile to where the live video that you do on your fan page shows up on your profile too. And you can tag it just by clicking, like in your little description, you can type in the at symbol on your cell phone and then type in your name. So that is another little hack. And here's the second one for live video, ask questions. And so you'll notice a lot of the times when I come on and I'm doing a live video, I'm telling people, hey, drop into the comments who you are, where you're coming in from. And then I might say, hey, like I did earlier, drop a one into the comments if you are currently doing live video. If you can get people commenting on your post, that's gonna have a lot of weight and Facebook is gonna say, hey, you know, People are commenting on this. People are liking it. They're engaging with it. So guess what happens? They're going to push it out into more people's newsfeed. Pretty smart, right? And here is my last and final hack. You can actually boost your posts. Now, obviously, this is not um, something that's free, but if you want to ensure that you get in people's newsfeed, underneath all of your posts on your fan page, there's a little blue button that says boost posts. What you can do is go in, say you want to boost it for $2 or $3, but you can ensure that your posts are getting in the news feed of your fans. A lot of the times when I boost a post over on my fan page, I'm boosting it to people who like my page and their friends. And that's because I know I'm trying to reach people who have a home business and maybe they want to learn really how to market and brand themselves online. And what I know is usually network marketers and home business owners, they are going to be friends and connected to other home business owners. Makes sense? So that's not a free strategy, but definitely a way that you can start making sure that your posts are getting seen in people's newsfeed. And so uh, I hope you guys got some value from this. If so, feel free to share out the replay. For those of you who maybe you want to really brush up your skills when it comes to marketing and branding and you maybe just don't know how to really do a lot of things, you might want to check out my Back to the Basics Academy. And so you can check that out by going to backtothebasicsacademy.com. And hope you guys have an awesome day. And until next time, bye.